the second and final phase of the 2019 general elections comes up on Saturday, March 9th, with Nigerians voting for governors and members of the Houses of Assembly in the states. Let me once again extend my condolences to the families of those who lost their lives or sustained injuries as a result of accidents or criminal violence during the elections. The onus is once again on qualified people to turn out in large numbers to exercise their civic rights. With the prudential poll behind us, let us not become complacent and fail to vote in the gubernatorial poll. The forthcoming elections are as important for good governance as that of the presidency and the National Assembly. Indeed, governance at the state level is closer to us and should touch our lives more directly. That is why it is vital for us to participate in the choice of who governs us at the state level. I, therefore, urge you to troop out massively on Saturday to elect your governors and state lawmakers. As a member of all progressive Congress, I recommend those standing on the platform of the party to you as we are guided by progressive ideals and we will not disappoint you. Equally, I urge you to comport yourself properly as you turn out for the election. Avoid all deviant behaviors like ballot stuffing, ballot snatching, and any other action that does not conform with best electoral practices. I assure you that the security agencies will be on hand to protect voters and ensure that the process is not undermined in any way. Let us make the gubernatorial polls much better than the presidential, which local and international observers have adjudged to be free and fair. May I repeat my appeal to our young people, do not allow yourselves to be used to cause violence or to break the law or otherwise disturb the peace. I have pledged decent and credible electoral system for our country. I stand by that promise. Let us together do the right thing on Saturday so that the best hands can emerge as the states and take us faster to the next level. Thank you and God bless our country. Amen.